Hello dear friends, welcome to this video. In this video, I'll be talking about this wonderful result that I need to prove that my i is set of all functions such that f of 0 is 0, that means 0 is the root of it, is a maximal ideal in R. Where the set of functions are coming from all continuous functions from real numbers to real numbers. A wonderful result and easy as well I will say to prove this I will prove that my this R I will prove that it is a maximal ideal right I wanted to prove it is a maximal ideal I want to prove this I is maximal ideal in R for that I will prove that my R by I is a field and over here, this result is easy because I can prove my R by I is isomorphic to a set of all real numbers. Right? I need to, to show that. For that, I will show this. And for that, I will show this. Now, as soon as I see this, something strikes my head. That is something. But first, isomorphism theorem. I will define a map. Define. Uh, f from not f because f we are using insights. I'll define phi from this R to capital real numbers set of all real numbers by what is this R? R is the thing but collection of all continuous function from real numbers to real numbers. So I define this phi of any function f is same as f of zero, right? Now, as the way we have defined, student can easily prove 5 is an onto homomorphism. Precisely a ring homomorphism, right? So, you will prove three properties. Every point has a pre image and two property of homomorphism. Once you have proved it is an onto homomorphism, by first isomorphism theorem. We can write my R mod kernel 5 is isomorphic to R. Now let's talk about the kernel 5 over here. Kernel 5 is nothing but collection of all F inside R such that my phi of F should be what? It should be 0. 0 of real numbers. So that is same as F inside R such that. How we have defined it phi of f that is nothing but f of 0 and given it as 0 which is actually same as i. Yes or no? Right? So therefore I conclude my r by i is isomorphic to set of all real number since this is a field which is a field implies my i is a maximal ideal. in R. It was an easy result. Some part I am keeping as an exercise but still if you are stuck somewhere, be free to ask at any time in the comment section. Okay? Thank you.